I would like to tell you maybe just a couple things about James. James is perhaps at the moment the most famous high school football player in the country. Uh, what, that, what does that actually mean? What does it actually mean to be the most famous high school football player in the country? Well, it means that uh, one of those highlight clips that you saw might be the front page of a site like yahoo.com and get the most hits of any uh, video that they had all year long. Uh, that's pretty famous for a high school young man. Uh, it might be that uh, uh, he's a man who had a thousand yards rushing. He had well over a hundred tackles. He had 19 sacks. Those are all football things and those are all things that many people know about James throughout the state and throughout the country. You don't have to go very far uh, online than to find something about James's football exploits. You don't have to pick up too many magazines before you see James Wilder uh, there at the front of football magazines uh, because he is that kind of player. Uh, he's one in a million, he's one of a kind. As a Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you James Wilder Jr. Um, first of all, I want to thank everybody um, for coming out and um, supporting me and my decision. Um, before I make my announcement, um, I want to say a few things first. And, um, first of all, I want to thank God. You know, I mean, He keeps me. He, he, he does it. Everything I do is through Him. I do everything through Christ. I want to thank my teammates for pushing me every day. I mean, working hard with me every day. We do. We wake up 5:30 in the morning. We work hard. Um, they do everything with me. They're they're more than teammates. They're. They're my family and they're my brothers. So um, I want to thank my coaches for pushing me hard, uh, getting me here. Um, they, they also help me every, with everything I do. I mean, I wouldn't have all these college decisions I could be making if it wasn't for these college coaches. So um, I want to thank them too. Um, the, I also want to thank the plant parents for um, supporting our foundation and our organization. Um, they don't really get that much credit. But uh, Mama Ely, Russo, and all the other moms, I don't want to name because I don't want to miss out on any. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> they, um, they don't get a lot of credit, but they, they, they look out for us a lot and um, have a lot to do with a lot of, um, that we do. Um, I also want to um, thank the Plant fans for coming out and supporting us. I mean, games wouldn't be as exciting if it was just like three people there and your mom and dad or something. So I also want to thank them for coming out and supporting us. Um, oh yeah, and the, the school I'm going to be choosing is... Uh, going to be told in a few moments. <laughs> um, I want to give a <laughs> I want to give a uh, special thanks to um, a couple of these people that um, mean a lot for me, for my life, in my life. Um, first, I want to thank Todd. <laughs> Todd has been my um, academic tutor. Um, not just an ordinary tutor. I mean, he comes to my school during my lunch period. And we'll tutor, we'll tutor about four or three hours a day, and um, he he definitely got me where I'm at. I don't I don't think I could be here without him right now in um, my academic situation. Um, I want to thank Coach Weiner. Coach Weiner helps me and I, um, me and my family out a lot. He helps a lot of players out. I mean, he you know he's definitely something special. It's not really a lot of coaches that's um, just for the players. I mean, most of the coaches just want you because you're good and have talent and you're good at football, but coach really likes me for who I am. And um, I, look, I, I ask him a lot of things, um, important questions. When I need him, he's always there for me. He always has his door open to me. Um, I also want to thank um, Mama Rogers and her family. Um, Dom and Mama Rogers, um, they've been helping me out a lot lately too. Um, they have a lot to do with um, what I've been doing lately. They hooked me up with Todd, my um, academic tu uh, tutor. Um, they, they, they're just amazing. I mean, they're like my second family. They uh, took me in. I mean, their doors are um, always also open to me. They help me with everything I do. Um, anytime I need them, they're always there with any, anything I ever need. And, um, I mean, I can honestly say I, like, I really love them like my family. They're my second family. So I um, also want to, you know, Scotty, um, her son, that's like my little brother, Tate and Reeves, like my little brothers, Abby's like my little sister. They're truly a second family to me. So um, I want to thank them and say I love them too. Um, I want to thank my immediately family. Um, my brother Curtis, um, he the one who first signed me up for football when I was too lazy to do anything else besides Nintendo 64. <laughs> um, he got me out there, um, he signed me up for football. And um, I mean, he the one who got me started. That's the person I train with a lot when people 
um, asked me who I trained with. Um, he really got me started. Um, got me started with working out. He kept me disciplined. He's always the main person that tells me um, just keep going no matter what happens. I mean, never give up. So he's a big inspiration in my life. Um, I also want to thank my parents, my mom and dad. They've been there f um, for me for the start. Um, I can also say I love them too. Also loving my brother. Um, he also, I mean, my mom and dad, they've they just been there from the start, helping me with everything I do, teach me everything I know to be a young man. And, um, you know, they taught me how to be a young man growing from a kid, and um, it was always there for me. I um, also want to thank um, my brother's wife, Selena uh, Wilder. Um, I mean, most people, when they take you in, I mean, they usually, I mean, the, the wife would usually be like, hold up or whatever, you know. But Selena never had a problem. And, um, I mean, she took me in, she also took me in. I mean, she helped me with everything. She always helped me with homework. And, um, she cooked some good um, lasagna, so. <laughs> so that was pretty good, too. And um, I also want to, um, you know, thank my little nephew. Um, he inspires me, too. My nephew is the one who keeps me going. Um, at first, when I was at Chamberlain, you know, I um, just played football just to play it. Um, I thought I was going to be a regular player just to have fun and play it. But um, when I found out that my nephew looks up to me, um, that, that, was just, that just made a whole big difference, the, um, how I look at football and how I look at myself. So um, I also want to say um, I thank my little nephew, uh, Curtis Wilder. Um, I also want to thank my girlfriend, Bianca. Um, She's been there through me, um, through thick and thin. Um, it'd be some night. I mean, she doesn't know much about football. I try to teach her. I mean, she'll talk to me about this whole recruiting process, just talking. She don't even know what she's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be talking to her, and she, she doesn't know what I'm talking about, but she'll, she'll always sit there and listen. So um, I want to thank her and um, say I love the Wilders and the Rogers and Bianca, too. So um, OK, for real, no, really. Um, the school that I am choosing is once again, going <laughs> to be tough <laughs> after I tell another story. Um, I want to tell you guys a story um, when I first started football. Um, <laughs> I first started football uh, for the Ebor City Eagles. You know, my brother was helping coaching there. Um, I was always a defensive guy playing linebacker and um, defensive line. So um, it, was the end, it was the end of the game. Um, my brother let me play running back. So it was the end of the game. I mean, we were, we were beating the other team by a lot. So he just gave me a shot at that. So um, it was my first chance. I always wanted to be a running back. So um, it was a toss play. I actually got a toss. I ran back to the middle, you know, a big crowd, got spent around, you know, closed my eyes. I was like nine years old, so. Um, opened my eyes and I seen open field. So when I seen open field, I mean, I just ran my hardest. And um, I looked to the sideline, you know, looking at my brother like, yes, I'm about to score, brother. <laughs> and um, I seen him like, wrong way, wrong way, turn around. <laughs> so <laughs> I, re I realized I was running backwards for um, about 30 yards before I got tackled by my own teammate. So uh, <laughs> that was quite embarrassing. So um, he didn't give up on me. So I want to thank I want to thank him for that. And um, another um, experience was the state championship with my brothers and my um, family. Um, brothers as meaning my teammates, um, blood brothers. So I mean they were there with me. We went through a lot. I mean we we did a, a quarter ceremony. We did a lot of things that actually found out how much I really love my um, teammates and how much I play for them. Most people just selfish and worry about stats and worry about, you know, just worry about their self. But, um, I mean, nope, not one person on our team is that selfish. I mean, we all look out for each other. When in practice, somebody's like, somebody's, you know, sluggish. I mean, we pick each other up. We, we call each other when we need help. I mean, if somebody ever needs a ride, we, we can always depend on each other. So I also want to thank my brothers and my teammate, um, teammates. And um, that was one of the greatest experiences of my life, playing in the state championship with um, those guys. So. Um, I wanted to thank everyone one more time, and now in all seriousness, the school I will be attending is